Hello? Hello, Mrs. T? Yes, it is. Hi, this is um, Roy from the Zoning Commission here in town. Uh-huh. And um, I just needed to let you know you're getting a new postman next week. He's going to be delivering okay. your mail. Okay. And he's disabled, though, so you need to build a wheelchair ramp on the front of your house. Uh, what? <laughs> you, you know, like he's in a wheelchair, and the only way he, he can get up to your door to deliver packages is if there's a wheelchair ramp. Okay, I don't think that's going to happen. What do you mean it's not going to happen? He's disabled. He has to be able to get up there. Okay, well, that would be the... um, uh, We have a curb that has a village ramp to go up to the sidewalk. Oh, yeah, I know that. leave it in my driveway. Of course, yeah. Uh, But, you know, he needs to be able to get up to your door. What if there's a package and he needs to ring your doorbell? And your name is again? My name is Roy Gerbel. I'm with the zoning board. Mm-hmm. Okay, that would mean that he'd have to do this to every house, wouldn't it? Yeah, well, he doesn't have to do it, but, you know, the homeowners... No, I'm th- saying every, every ho- homeowner would have to do that then, correct? Oh, yeah, we're contacting everyone that doesn't have one already that's not in compliance with the Disabilities Act of 2004. Okay, well, then he could probably just leave my packages at the post office, and then I can leave a note, and I can pick them up No, there. that's retarded. Don't be retarded, ma'am. No, Excuse you d- me? I'm sorry. Retarded is not the word to be using. Well, you're the one I that's... like your last name again, please? You're the one that's, uh, you know, discriminating against disabled people. I'm sorry. You do not say that word. All right. Well, at least I don't discriminate. I have a wheelchair ramp in front of my house. Well, that's wonderful. And, and I support the troops. What does that have to do with a he, veteran? He, he's disabled. A, a disabled person. I'm sorry. He's disabled from the war. He was in Afghanistan. What is, spell your last name, please. Oh, sure. It's G-H-E-R-B-I-L. And you're calling from where? I'm in the zoning board. The zoning board. Yep. So, okay, you're telling every homeowner... To put in a ramp. How else is he going to deliver the mail? We have we have curbs that have ramps to go up on the sidewalk. But you have steps so up to your get house. If he to the sidewalk, then he can deliver the mail in to my driveway, or else I can pick it up at the post He's office. He's not going to throw it in your driveway. Don't be retarded, ma'am. You need to stop using that word. Well, at least I don't discriminate I against special needs children for quite a few years. All right, and I'm this, sorry. This, yeah, you right. You better hang up. Uh, what? I'm not going to hang up. No, I. We still have more to talk about. Um, you need to get a life. What? I have a life. Thing. I have a if job here at the people, zoning. If you're calling people retarded, well, you're the then one. Why are you calling me to tell me that I need to put a ramp on my? Uh, least, on my. Uh, you're the one that's racist. Link. You're the racist here. Uh, who's racist? When did we bring in the word racist here? Well, because he's he's a black male man. Racist has nothing to do with the word retarded. Well, you're you're saying it's that you don't want black people coming up to your door because he's a black male man and you won't put the wheelchair I ramp. Don't so think, you're basically I don't a racist. Think I even mentioned the word black. Well, you know, you don't have to say it. We can tell by your actions. Roy, you need to get a life. <laughs> well, what are you? T- I'm doing my job here. Hello. Hello, Catherine. Yeah. Hey, this is Roy from the zoning board here in town. Uh huh. And I just needed to let you know that um, you're getting a new postman next week. Uh huh. And uh, he's he's a disabled postman. He's going to be in a wheelchair, and uh, you need to build a wheelchair ra- ramp onto the front of your house. What? You know, so he can get up to the door if there's a package. Ma'am, hello. Yeah, I'm listening. Okay. Yeah, you just need to. Um, he he starts on Thursday next thursday so not tomorrow but a week after so we need to have that wheelchair ramp built by thursday uh who is this uh this is roy from the zoning board i don't know who roy roy who what do you mean roy do, do you know everyone at the zoning board or something no i don't that's why i'm asking okay roy who. well you're acting like you, you don't, don't have to get temperamental with me here. oh Wait i'm not minute. temperamental at all you're Wait the one that's being all Who's weird talk is that to me what's with the attitude well, you're the one that's getting an attitude. I, I just told you you have to build no, a, a ramp. No, you're questioning me because I'm questioning what's your name, 
Okay. I don't have. I don't get to know your name. You're acting like you don't of know. Of course, I don't, don't know, know everybody on the board. Okay, That's all right. why I'm asking. All right, this sorry. Doesn't make any sense? Every house in the neighborhood has to have a ramp. Yes, every single one. He's only going to be delivering on Thursdays. Is all. Just one day a week. But and I have to build a ramp? Are you kidding me? No, not at all. It's the Americans with Disabilities Act of 2004. I don't understand you at all. I really don't. Could you put this in a letter and mail it to me? Um, yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll, be, we'll be mailing a letter out, I guess, since you can't take instructions over the phone. Simple instructions. No, build, no, build I the stupid can't. ramp. What is the way? What are you talking like this for? Well, you're being kind you of a jerk. You work for the village? Yeah, but you're being kind of a jerk. I, I just, you just need to build I'm a ramp. I'm being a, a jerk? You need to build a, build a ramp. That's all. It's not that hard. You're, you're not making any sense. Um, how does this not make sense? He's disabled. How else is he going to get up to your door? You don't sound legitimate to me, to be quite frank. Well, that's kind of rude. <laughs> I'm rude. You called me. Yeah, that doesn't mean you can't be rude at me. Stop being so rude. I'm not being rude. I'll, I'll call down to the utilities department and have them shut off your water. How do you like that? What? I've done it before. Don't don't try me, lady. And what you Roy Roy what? Don't try it, lady? I said don't try me. Don't try me, lady? That's right. Uh-huh. Do you have, is your supervisor there right now? Uh he's I'm sorry, he's on the toilet right now. Post office, this is Sandy. Can I help you? Oh, hello, Sandy. Um, I, I received a call saying I have to install a wheelchair ramp for the new disabled postman, and I just needed to who, know... Who, who called you? Oh, some guy named Roy. I just needed to know which day I need that installed by. Okay, but I need to know, do you have a phone number for Roy? Because whoever this Roy is, is... The post office is not going to ask you to put a ramp in. Well, how would the disabled postman get to my door? Who is the disabled postman? I don't know. That's what they said on the phone. But, uh, but uh, no, who are they? I, I don't know. They said we're getting a new postman. <coughs> and I need what to is t- your address? Uh, I live over on uh, East Prairie Drive. Cindy is your mail person. Oh, okay. Yeah, they said Cindy's qu- quitting, and there's going to be a new disabled huh? person. And I said I didn't want to, and they called me. Uh, they said I didn't like disabled people, and I, I hated my country, and didn't like veterans. Oh, no, 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 and, no. Do you have a phone number for those and, persons, and whoever they, are calling you? And they said I'm racist. Oh, well, it's the zone. You know, I don't care what they, you need to call the police. What? What? No, why would I call the police? Because the post office isn't going to tell you to put a disabled ramp in, first of all. Your carrier is not leaving. Okay, oh, I have well, one that's person good to hear. retiring. Cindy's a good we person. We have not replaced anybody. Huh? I said Cindy's a good person. I'm glad she's not leaving. She's not leaving, but I want to know who's calling you folks. What was the and, name? Um, Who, my name or their name? No, the people that are calling you. Oh, uh, he said his name is Roy. And the new disabled postman, his name is Steve. <laughs> what are they delivering? Uh, well, they said it's just the regular mail, but, but um, you know, in case they need to come up and deliver a package. What is the number that was on the call? Do you have caller ID? Yeah, yeah, I have the number here. Okay. It's 8... That's the number to the village hall, and I already called them. They gave me your number. But somebody's calling from inside the village. Yeah, maybe they're just playing a joke on people. Maybe it's a slow day there. That, that's probably what it is. Well, I had somebody over from Majestic call me with the same thing. From what? Over on Majestic. Oh, you know okay. Where Majestic is? Yeah, yeah. It's just around the corner, sort of. Okay. Well, he called me to find out what the heck is going on. So you don't hire disabled people there? I hire disabled people, but I don't. I don't put out. I don't put out phone calls for people to have to put in ramps to their house. Well, what if you had a a, a mailman that that delivered the mail that was disabled? What if I had a mail person that was disabled? Yeah. What if it was a wheelchair? He was in a wheelchair and delivering the mail. Like, how would he get up to the houses? It kind of makes sense when you think about it. If a person is disabled, we wouldn't put him in a position where they would have to walk. We would put him in a different job. Well, he wouldn't walk. He would roll around in his wheelchair because it has I, to. Be- I think you guys are playing a joke on me. What? Is somebody playing a joke on me? No, no. I. I'm, oh my goodness! I, I just live over here on Prairie Drive. Oh, what the heck! No, I was First just of all, Cindy's not leaving. April is retiring from over on Majestic. But as far as 
hiring a disabled person, we do hire disabled people. Oh, that's okay? good. We, okay, we hire hearing impaired. Do you hire black huh? people? We hire black, we hire all people. Okay, all right. We have all races, all eth- ethnic, I can't even say it right. <laughs> that's okay. Why I can't in either. God's name? I don't understand where this is coming from. I would just like to talk to the person who's been calling you folks. Yeah, me, uh, me too. Maybe he'll call me back. I'll, I'll give him a piece of my mind if he does. Well, you don't have to give him a piece of your mind, but you know what? I, I need proof of who you who you say you are. You're saying you're calling for the for the post on behalf of the post office. Me? No, no. I'm just a resident here. I'm talking here. about the per- the person that called you. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. You said that they called and said that you needed to install a ramp because there, we hired a disabled a disabled mail carrier. Yeah, and I was thinking and uh, he's in the a post wheelchair. office they wouldn't hire disabled people. We you know what disability we hire people with disabilities but we don't put them in a position that they can't do. Yeah, well no, they could do it. They just need the wheelchair ramps, I think. How are they going to get the package out of the truck? You know those uh, electric. This is a very. This is a very great. I understand, but the post office isn't going to put a lift in there. Yeah, they could put a lift in the mail truck. That would work. Oh, I think somebody's. I think somebody's playing with me here. I really do. It must be. I don't know. It's just weird. It was the weirdest call I got. That is bizarre. Okay. Well. Um, you know, like I said, we have dis- We have people with disabilities. Yeah. We have people in wheelchairs. We have people with hearing impairments you know we have all different types of people all races all creeds all colors it has nothing to do with any of that okay all this right well that's not about age or anything else that's it's good to hear specifically you know hold on a minute here you know when you're hired to do different positions there's qualifications for the positions it's no different than being a veteran what if you know? What if a wheelchair person really wanted to be a post uh, a delivery person though? Couldn't they do that? You know, in in this area because it's it's what it is. Mm-hmm. I'm not saying they can't do that, but I'm I'm saying that it would be very difficult for them. Yeah, they'd have to get people to install wheelchair ramps at their homes. Are the customers out on the roads going in- to install wheelchair ramps on their property? Well, if they have a disabled mailman in a wheelchair. God bless them, I tell you. But you know what? I, I'm just really baffled by this phone call of of people calling out there, yeah. different people on different routes saying that you're getting a new mail carrier, and we've hired it. We haven't even replaced April. Yeah, I'm glad. So I'm, how I, in God's name do they know that? I like April. That? April's got a nice ass. Oh, What did you just say? I said she's a nice person. Oh, no, I know you're playing games here. Okay, thank you very much. Bye. You're, you're welcome. Goodbye. Oh, shit. Dial tone time. Hello. Can I help you? Hello. Who is this? This is Dave. Okay. Um, is this the village hall? Yes, it is. Can who, who do you need? Who can I transfer you to? What department do you work in, Dave? I'm in the utilities department. You're in the utilities department because there's. Um, could I talk to? Let's see who. What I would like to talk to. Uh, may I talk to the village secretary? Is she in right now? Uh, can I tell her who's calling, please? Yeah, the postmaster from. Oh, the post. Uh, she she yeah. says if the postmaster calls, she does not like the postmaster, <laughs> and she will not talk to the postmaster. I don't. I'm sorry. I don't believe that. No, that's what she said. She said she will not take calls. She hates that lady. Don't put her through. Just tell her to f off. But I'm not going to say that word. Okay. Then I guess I want to talk to the mayor. Mayor? No, n- you, you can't just talk to the mayor, ma'am. The mayor is a very important person. He's out I understand it. the mayor is a very important person. He's out having a haircut right now. So he can't talk. He's out getting his haircut. What is your last name, Dave? Zerbel. You want to spell that for me, please? No. No, I do not. Why, why should I do that? What, what, okay. who, who do you think you are? No wonder she doesn't like you. Oh, excuse me? 
No wonder she doesn't like you. You're being all demanding and asking weird questions and thinking you're thinking you're high enough to talk to the mayor. Nobody talks oh. to the mayor here. Okay. Except for me. Oh, I, I'm the mayor's you? assistant. Okay, thank you very much. And what, what do you want with the mayor? What's going on here? What do you think you're doing? Um, goodbye. What, what do you mean goodbye? Why are you whispering? I'm not whispering. Goodbye. You kind of were. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Hello, City of Can I help you? Hi, this is the postmaster from... Oh, hello, ma'am. How are you? Oh, pretty good. How are you doing today? Good. Can I ask who I'm talking to? This is Willie. Huh? This is Willie. This is Willie? Willie. Okay, Willie. I got a couple phone calls. Do you have a last name, Willie? Of course. It's Willie Carter. Willie Carter? Okay. Carter. Willie Carter. Carter. C-O-C-O-T-T-E-R-O-R. Carter. Oh, Carter. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, I had a few people from out there in town calling me, telling me that they're getting a phone call from somebody at the village hall stating that I am replacing my carrier with a handicap carrier and they have to install ramps so that the carrier can deliver packages. Well, if if, if they're in a wheelchair, it kind of makes sense. Okay. I, I mean, how, how else would they get up to the door? You know? Okay. Hmm. Don't you, don't you think? I mean, how how the hell else would they get up there? Wow. Okay, thank you. Uh, you're welcome, ma'am. Bye. A weird, weird, weird-ass question. <laughs>